Radioactivity is the general term used for atoms that have unstable nuclei. This includes nuclei that have a ratio of neutrons to protons that is too high or too low, and all atoms with 83 or more protons in the nucleus are unstable or radioactive. Unstable nuclei tend to rearrange to more stable arrangements, and this rearranging causes the emission of radiation. This process of rearrangement is also known as radioactive decay since the original nucleus is changing to something else. Isotopes that spontaneously emit radiation are known as radioactive or radioisotopes. Radiation can take the form of particles and or high energy electromagnetic radiation which is a form of energy transfer. As we mentioned, all elements with an atomic number of 83 or higher are radioactive. There are a handful of radioactive isotopes with lower atomic numbers, and radioactive elements can be mined, and some are synthesized in the lab. The forms of radiation we will consider are alpha particles, beta particles, gamma rays, which is a type of electromagnetic radiation, and positrons and neutrons, both of which are particles. The alpha particle was the first type of radiation discovered, which occurred before the structure of the atom was determined. Alpha particles are actually the nuclei of helium atoms with two protons and two neutrons, thus a mass number of four and atomic number of two. Since scientists didn't know about the structure of atoms, they didn't identify alpha particles as helium nuclei at first. The symbol for helium or the Greek letter alpha can be used to signify an alpha particle. We will use the mass and the atomic number along with the alpha or helium symbol. When a nucleus emits an alpha particle, the nucleus becomes smaller by two protons and two neutrons. A beta particle is an electron traveling at high speed. Again, these particles were discovered before the structure of atoms were determined, so scientists didn't have a name for electrons yet. We can use either the Greek letter beta or a lowercase e. Notice the mass number of zero and an atomic number of negative one. Beta particles are emitted from neutrons, which then transform into protons. Gamma rays are the highest energy form of electromagnetic radiation. Microwaves, visible light, ultraviolet light, infrared, x-rays are all types of electromagnetic radiation, but they have less energy than gamma rays. The Greek letter gamma is the symbol, and there is a mass number of zero, as well as an atomic number of zero. A positron is a po like a positively charged electron. It has the same mass as an electron. Positrons are emitted from protons, which then convert to neutrons. Positrons do not last very long after they are emitted, because as soon as they collide with an electron, which all atoms have, the mass of the positron and electron are converted to energy and gamma radiation is produced. Notice the mass number of zero and the atomic number of plus one. Neutrons are symbolized by a lowercase n with a mass number of one and an atomic number of zero.